and welcome to Rough Gear Review. Today we're going to have a quick look at the Smith & Wesson M&P 22CA. This is their California compliant version 22 long rifle pistol. This is a great pistol. We're going to show you some of its features. Alright, so here we have the Smith & Wesson M&P 22CA. This is the California compliant version. It's going to come with a 10 round magazine. If you don't live in California, you get a 12 round magazine. I'll show you some of the features on this. This has an ambidextrous safety. Also has an ambidextrous slide release. Magazine release button. You can switch it to the other side so the gun's completely ambidextrous. Comes with a rail. You can install a light on it if you want to. This gun is full size. Feels real good in your hand. Matter of fact, the 9mm version of this is the same overall length and weight. Of course, the 9mm bullets will weigh more, but it's about as close as you're going to get. Overall length on this is 7.6 inches. This weighs 24 ounces unloaded. This gun is a single action internal hammer. It's got a 4.1 inch fixed barrel, an adjustable rear sight, polymer frame, aluminum alloy slide. Now, this is actually made by Carl Walther in Germany and then imported to the U.S. by Smith & Wesson. When it comes to 22s, Carl Walther makes some great 22s. They do the HK MP5s, the HK416, the Uzi. They make all those, and those guns are imported here into the U.S. by Umarex. Umarex doesn't make them, they just import them here. Just like this, Smith & Wesson didn't make this. Walther made it, Smith & Wesson imported it in here. But this is an excellent gun. Unlike a lot of the other guns like this, say the Sig Mosquito, which is very picky on ammo, this gun will feed anything. There's probably close to a thousand rounds for this gun already. Not had one jam, no failure to fires, no failure to feeds, nothing. Very reliable, and that makes it a lot of fun to go out and shoot. I'm going to show you the internals on here. First thing you do, push that lever down, and you're going to pull it out. Now unlike most guns like this where the slide goes forward, this is a fixed barrel. So you're going to pull it back up and then over. Got your recoil spring, your recoil guide, and you can see here this is the fixed barrel. It doesn't move. We'll put it back together real quick. And you can see there, it goes back together real easy. Nice serrations on the side. This is an excellent gun. Thanks for watching Rough Gear Review.